Welcome back to Pennsylvania Outdoor Life. Guess what's back? People and places. You've been sending us your photos. We put together this week's segment of Pennsylvania People and Places. We'll begin things this week with Darlene Messenger, along with her grandson Connor Messenger, and the carp that she caught while fishing at the Riverlands Recreation Area near Berwick. Darlene's carp weighed 17 and a half pounds and was released to fight another day. John Caldwell of West Pittston was trolling for muskies on the Susquehanna River near Laceyville when he hooked into the muskie of a lifetime. <laughs> it turned out that John hooked into a flathead catfish that put up one heck of a fight. His flathead catfish was close to four feet in length and weighed just shy of 40 pounds. Next, we see Jason Coop of Milton and just one of the many coyotes that he harvested recently. Jason's coyote was shot with a 22 250 Way to go, Jason. After seeing our story with Doug Jones of Two Fish Guide Service, Don Can and her husband decided to book a trip for their anniversary, and it certainly didn't disappoint. Don and her husband had a blast and caught 59 bass, two channel catfish, and a bonus walleye. Way to go, guys, and happy belated anniversary. Here's Foster Casella from Factoryville and his largest fish to date. Foster is seen here with the six pound largemouth bass that he caught while fishing with his dad, Steve, at a pond in Wyoming County. Way to go, Foster. Next, we see 12 year old AJ Miller and the beautiful trout that he caught while fishing at a kids fishing derby in Columbia County. AJ's brown trout measured 22 inches in length. Congratulations, AJ. Farm ponds are a great way to introduce kids to fishing. Eight-year-old Parker Van Dyke of Ulster took advantage of his pond and pulled out this monster bass. Parker's largemouth bass measured 24 inches in length and weighed a whopping five pounds. Next, we see Bob Krukovitz of Oliphant and the largemouth bass that he caught while fishing from his kayak at Lake Cary in Wyoming County. Bob's largemouth bass measured 16 inches in length and weighed two and a half pounds. He caught this nice bass on a homemade six inch cream and black night crawler. Way to go, Bob. Kayak fishing seems like the thing to do with the recent low water conditions. Bob Rutkowski is seen here with the huge bass that he caught out of his kayak on Lackawanna Lake this summer. He tells us that this bass pulled him around for about 10 minutes before giving up. Bob's bass was caught using a Texas rigged black rubber worm. Way to go, Bob. And with all of our successful sportsmen out there, we'll put a close to this week's edition of Pennsylvania People and Places. Hey, look it, we love showing people your photos. If you get a big mushroom, as long as you're in the photo with it, send it to us your kids' first squirrels, anything that you harvest, any fish that you catch, as long as you're in the photo with it, send it to us. We can use it on Pennsylvania people and places. We're taking a short break and we'll be right back.